can't pay this $2,000 rent. But here today, you're complaining about how you can't pay your $10,000 rent, how you can't pay your $50,000 for your employees. Why you, and I'm like, do you not see how your problems have evolved from just measly 2K to now you're worrying about 150K, which you're most likely probably going to get tomorrow. And the way it came off was harsh as hell. But it had her re-examine how she was complaining. And it was like, well, dang, you know, I am. She was like, Chris, I am making so much more. I'm doing so much better. I'm living in such a better place. But I wasn't going to sit here and coddle her because of that. I was going to tell her what it was. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Forget all that coddling. Yo, oh, yeah. Like some things, some, some, like that, that right there. Yeah, no, you don't have to coddle. No, no. Um, I think I'm going to just say this. When it comes to, to the mom and the, like, all, all of the stuff that you said to me, it, it just sounds horrible, right? I mean, ain't no sound. It, it's, it is. It's horrible. Yeah. It's horrible. And how I look at it is, you know, sometimes people, you know, like your mother, you know, she, a, a lot of things happen to her that wasn't her fault, you know, and, you know, you're, you're there to support her and you seem to be a straight shooter, which isn't a bad, it's not a bad thing. It, it's not, but, you know, I think for me, it's, it's knowing that she's emotionally um, invested is why, you know, I'm saying like, not necessarily take the logic out of it, but try to meet, her where she's at you know so that she can you know at least feel that someone actually cares for her because in my own experience you know like with whatever it's like sometimes people just need to hear you tell them you know oh no i, I got i got you you know i i get i get what you're saying or i understand where you're coming from I've noticed a change in people when like we're communicating and they're upset about something. It's like, once you let them know, you know, that you understand where they're coming from, there's a, a, a difference in them. You know, it's, it's like when you're a little, when you're subtle with your, um, when, when you come at them subtly and not so harshly is what I'm saying, you know, because, I, I, I get it. I mean, I'm not saying that, you know, I want you to, you know, tell your mother, you know, some bullshit because you're telling her right. But it's really going to be up to her, you know. But I think with a little, you know, a little more emotional support, Lionel, I, I wouldn't <laughs> listen to Miss <Mr>. Lounge. <laughs> I think a little, a, little, a little more emotional support, I think she'll she'll be able to let go, you know, little by little. It won't happen overnight. Look, Lionel, don't 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 let this woman don't let this woman manipulate you. I'm not manipulating. <laughs> she is she is trying her best to make you just better this whole situation out. Don't look, he can't be a beta male. He he got it. He already told the he already told his mama straight up what it is. He he like it is. <laughs> yeah, and that's that's the you. Her. And that's say, you know, Lionel, he's going to be out coddling this mom and stuff. Come on. <laughs> Mommy, why are, you, why are you being all emotional? Oh, Lord. No, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> he, he he definitely got it. If he told her that straight to her face, ain't going to be, he did not, ain't going to be no coddling at all. Ain't going to be no coddling. <laughs> but, you know, just ease up on her. You know, you just, just ease up on her. Boy, I tell you, women, women, women. Hey, E A E, <laughs> hey, E A E, hey. The answer to the question, bro. I'm I walk her in the same direction where they at, and I'm dabbing them up and saying, "What's up with it?" Oh Lord. <laughs> e A E, E A E, fool, man. Wait, before before we go, Mister Lodge, I got one question. So you ain't never said something harsh, not not derogatory towards your wife. So you ain't mm -hmm. never been harsh towards your wife in a situation and later you think about it and be like, babe, honey, sugar, whatever you call it. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
you ain't you ain't come back to her with a softer tone, a softer approach. Nope. Cause Shaking it, cause, my head. Ooh, cause, I, cause I meant what I said. That that goes back earlier. Now, now listen, 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 listen. That that goes Dang back old. earlier. <laughs> that 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 goes back earlier. What I was talking to y'all about that parenting situation when I was asking y'all about uh, did did they, did y'all renege on that or did did y'all carry the sentence through? If you if you set up her renege on on something that that was said right then the next time around there's gonna be the, the same expectation you yep. need to be more softer and gentle you need to be softer than now nah, i meant what i said now if now she comes to me and say it, it hurt her feelings and stuff like that then what i would do i would explain it to her the reason why i said what i said but i'm not gonna change my tone Shaking so i thought what we head. do do i so i thought we do our kids you know what I'm saying? they get mad well well you some some of y'all y'all be separate cussing your kids out and stuff then you go back around and explain so the reason why you cussed <laughs> them out right <laughs> Um, no, what I was going to say was, um, I had one experience, you know, with Jim, you know, he gave it to me real, like, you know, he didn't want to hear it. He, you know, it was like, no, no, no. And I told him he hurt my feelings and he, he changed his, um, he didn't change his stance now. Okay. Cause he, you know, he wasn't going, but you know, he definitely acknowledged that he hurt. That's, I think that's what I'm asking. Like, do y'all acknowledge when y'all didn't hurt somebody's feelings? Because that's important. Do, do, I'm I'm a, I'm a reverse Uno this song. Y'all gonna do a reverse chord. Do you acknowledge your feelings when when you be um hurting your your husband feelings on purpose? That's the that's the winning argument. I ain't never did that. <laughs> be so no, Okay, look. Okay, I, let me not tell that mm -hmm. lie. Okay. Okay. Has, yeah, has yeah. I, 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 I know you did it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, yeah. Y'all, y'all be in the heated, maybe <laughs> set up here in the heated argument, and you know what he's saying is facts, but you don't want to accept it. This, this, this why you fat. Oh no, I ain't never said that. Um, <laughs> or no, break, break, or um, something that happened like five or six years ago. Like, okay, man, I don't have you, nothing to do with the I, argument. You, you know what I do? You want to know what I do for real? I start crying and say, why are you throwing stuff in my face? <laughs> That's what I do. Do you apologize about that? Uh, no, cause you meant, you, you meant what you was doing. <laughs> cause you was crying. No. Um, so, so why no, do we I, have to apologize? Okay, do I, do I, do I apologize? No, but do I recognize that? He was telling the truth and I got mad and it wasn't nothing I could argue with. So I started crying. Yeah. But see, he knows that. So why do I? <laughs> why? why? That's the point that we make it that. No. You know different. that, you know, you, you know, what we're we doing or you know that we're not doing it to hurt your feelings, but we, we're doing it just to give you a different perspective. Now, if right? we're arguing and I blurted out, that he was fat. Okay, yeah. Anybody gonna apologize for that? Just like he gonna apologize for saying, you know, I said I love your toes, but they really look like aliens. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like you, <laughs> you gonna apologize what? when you when you really wrong. But have I ever apologized for that? I don't think so. When, when you not. really, really, when you really wrong. <laughs> I, I I I can't no more line. I, I can't. I can't. It's too. I late mean, it's a difference in being. This. It's a difference in being petty wrong. You know, then really wrong. It's a difference. Do you do you see how she keep constantly moving the goalposts? <laughs> no, I'm make not, something I'm as playing. as simple just... and start making it as complex as possible. No, I'm I'm just playing, Mister Lounge. No, I apologize <laughs> when I I do. I apologize when I'm wrong. Do he forgive me right away? Of course not. Do I forgive him right away? You know, absolutely not. But I do apologize when I'm wrong because. You, you don't want your spouse to, you know, walk around feeling like you don't love them. Like, who wants to do that? You know, like, that's not right. But that's, that's not the whole argument, though, about if you being right around or anything like that. You, you're talking about the, the whole tone. And that's the whole point I was <laughs> making is that at the end of the day, you, you're not going to, if you, if, if you know what you're saying is right and you know what you're saying is, is needed at that moment, you're not going to apologize about that. You're going to say what you have to say. 
Like if you mad at your, your husband for whatever reason it is, you meant what you said. And you're not going to go back and apologize. Baby, I'm sorry for what I said. You, you're not oh, going to do that because your pride and ego is not going to allow you to do that. No, -uh, but you're right, though, because he's not going to apologize to me when he meant what he said either. Uh-uh. So what, that. that's the point. <laughs> why, why you had an expectation for him to do yeah. that? That's the point. Ooh. When did I say I had the expectation, Mr. Loud? When did I say that? You just said it earlier. You 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 just said it early. Even with Lionel in this situation, you said talking about you just need to be so soft and gentle like a beta. <laughs> 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 Maybe you know then only then she'll understand you. You know what? Whatever. <laughs> okay. Because if he apologized to me, I mean, if if he said what he. First of all, let me tell you something, Mr. Lyles. I think you know by now. Jim ain't going to apologize for nothing he meant. Okay? He ain't going to apologize for that. <laughs> now. Then why are we having this whole debate, Vaz? I think he just doing it uh -uh, on purpose. Uh -uh, uh -uh. See, you, see, you didn't move the goalposts because I don't expect I didn't move no goalposts. Yeah. I ain't moving nothing. Uh -uh. I don't expect him. I don't expect him to apologize for anything that he like really believes in when it comes to me right so when that situation was going on with my mom i mm -mm, he didn't he never apologized to me and i didn't expect one either because at the end of the day as my spouse and somebody you know who saw how i changed you know ever since certain things took place between me and my mom you know he he brought me back so he mm -mm, he won't he didn't need to be sorry for that but what i will say is you know when I felt he was gentle and cuddly, okay? All right? that That's when I was able to hear him. Now, you can call it beta, okay? You can say I manipulated, but that ain't what happened. <laughs> it was, that's that, not what happened. That, that was a... That that wasn't a beta situation. You just you just manipulated that dude. You probably rub rubbed on his head and stuff, uh, grab his balls and stuff. <laughs> then he probably said something. Yeah, you know what, babe. No, I went, Mr. Lyles, no, man. I went to therapy and realized I was going crazy. Okay, not going crazy, but you know, I had a couple of screws loose. That that's all. <laughs> but no, I um, mm -mm. but no, I don't. I don't do a whole lot of apologizing. I ain't gonna tell that lie. Mm -mm. Not a whole lot. Yeah, cause cause um, cause the the average woman when they apologize with their with their um spouse, they apologize with sex instead of with their words. Yeah. You know what? See that be you. See you be up here. You be up here <laughs> playing. Be up here. I'm being dead serious. That's, that's what y'all do. Men, we apologize with with our words and our action. Y'all action is sex. Because um, it's because y'all probably ego wouldn't allow y'all to say Look, that y'all sorry. And take accountability. Throw in some cologne, a nice steak and potato meal. You know, a back rub. You know, um, which all that equates to sex. You know what I'm just saying. You know, you you gotta, you you gotta let them know you still love them. You, I mean, you really have to, because um, I will say sometimes you, you know, when you say things to a man that you shouldn't say, you know, they don't forget that shit. You know, so it's like you know you gotta, what the, you gotta kiss up to them. You got. <laughs> You got to be like, uh-uh, you know, I ain't going to let nobody else come take my man because, you know, we had a moment. You, you got to. Why, why would, hold up, why would you think <laughs> like that? Out for um, a disagreement. I did think that was interesting. <laughs> because, I the, you, you know, you, okay, so I'm going to put it to you like this. Everybody swear they know Vaughn, but um, Jim is um a smooth criminal, okay? And with that being said, he know how to get in my head, okay? He 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 know how to get me to be like, uh uh, you know, which I don't think is a bad of thing. Of course, of course, because he's <laughs> your husband. That's what he's supposed right. to do. Right. So it's like, uh uh, you know, we had a moment, but mm -mm, I'm not gonna, you know, let this shit linger on, and you know, everybody else, you know, think because you know he. He a cutie, so you know pe pe people be hating. I'm gonna say that. <laughs> <laughs>
Hey, hey, Lana, you, you have any closing thoughts? Because um, uh, she's nah, trying to stay up here longer. Yeah, I know. No, nah, it was I, a good show, I'm man. Because go, y'all, y'all didn't, y'all didn't got me right where y'all want me. Okay, being the average woman, so I'm gonna go. <laughs> yep, average is best. <laughs> Whatever, y'all have a nice night. Have a and great night. Know, Hey, hey, hey! I I appreciate you want to pull it up on the cool though, Vons. No problem. I just want. I look. I want. You know, I'm nosy. I'm like, let me go ask Lionel some questions because uh, this is a pretty interesting story. And I'm gonna follow it on YouTube. I'm gonna follow it. I'm gonna um drop down and grab the link before the live disappear. So yeah, yeah she have a got nice her night. documentaries up there. It's already up there. Yeah, she has a documentary where she talks, where she'll claim I forced her to do it, but she put it up there. Okay. All right, well, y'all have a nice night. Bye. Have a great night.